on the topic of mouthpieces, ligatures, and especially the neck. Cork compression. This problem, cork compression, or changing from one mouthpiece to another, is very typical, especially if you use a Selmer Larry Teal or a C Star mouthpiece for your classical playing, and something much like the Meyer for your jazz playing. The shank of the Meyer is much smaller than the teal. The Meyer ends up compressing the cork so that when you put on the teal, it's a loose fit. That's because this is a little bit bigger than that. So the Meyer compresses the cork so that you don't get a good seal at all with your classical mouthpiece. So what one must do is to put some paper around the cork so it fits tighter. A couple of hints with this procedure. In my opinion, it's very uncool to have any paper showing. Learn to cut slash tear your paper the right length and width to be just right. I've always wanted to try to market an item that is a disposable tear-off piece of paper, much like a post-it note, that looks like cork. I'd call it Instacork or Cork Me. Now, I haven't patented this idea yet, so don't steal it. But for now, we'll just use the tried and true method of just ripping off a piece of paper. And you got to find just the right length and width. Wrap it around. That's going to be a little wide. There we go. Stick it around like that. And then all of a sudden you have a good fit with your classical mouthpiece. 